We are presenting a project with a collaboration with uh, General Electric. It's about an evaluation for the uh, electricity, se electricity sector in terms of saving and uh, potential saving and enhancements. Uh, this project that we're working on uh, is actually focusing on the local biomass uh, that grows in the mangrove areas of the UAE. Uh, and what we're doing is working with this biomass to produce a various range of the bioproducts, uh, which includes energy such as uh, bioethanol and biogas as biofuels, but uh, we're actually shifting our focus uh, to, towards the chemical that could be produced from this biomass and that includes uh, organic acids such as uh, lactic or acidic uh, that can be produced during the fermentation processes. We have identified a waste stream that is very important to the soil which is have high content of carbon. Uh, this element is very important to the soil and it's improved uh, the soil quality in terms of fertility, uh, filtration and also the structure. The novelty in our project is to identify um, this kind of material that is thermally resistant and provide uh, many benefits to the soil itself. The main idea here is to develop a robot that can interact with the human in a more efficient and effective way. Uh, we de demonstrate a demo in which we have nine blocks and then through the interaction with the robot, the robot learns how to interact with us. So through the information the robot gains from this interaction, he will be able to learn to effectively communicate with us. During uh, the prayer time, uh, usually people uh, they do ablution before uh, prayer. And uh, after a study we did on uh, one of the mosques, we found that uh, people they are using uh, around uh, 20 liters for uh, every ablution. So uh, we create uh, this mechanical device, as you can see, which can uh, contain around uh, 600 milliliters. And, uh, we found that 600 milliliters is uh, enough uh, quantity to be used for one ablution, one full ablution. As you can see, uh, once you fill uh, the bowl with the water, uh, you can just move it like this and the water will come out from the discharge. The aim of my project is to minimize the inorganic fouling in seawater reverse osmosis desalination plant using single step pretreatment using electric field. My project is about soil regeneration. As you know, our, uh, the soil in UAE is very dry and it's very hard to plant anything anytime we want. So I'm using these microbeads that will entrap the bacteria that benefits the plant growth and they will accumulate in these beads which are porous and they also have another benefit uh, which is uh, water retention. Once you plant them on, uh, on top of soil, they will start releasing the nutrients directly to the plant and they will help releasing, uh, the, they will release all the nutrients that the plant needs. This will, will help the plant to grow better and faster. It's also scientifically proven, but it's, all, it's been proven in uh, areas that is easier to plant, that has better climate uh, for planting. The challenge that I'm trying to overcome is uh, to actually make these beads work in our um, in our climate, and like in summer when it goes up to 50 degrees. And I hope it works and I will have the first results by summer, I hope so. بحثي هو عن استخلاص الكائنات الدقيقة من معدة الجمل. هذه الكائنات الدقيقة نستخدمها عشان تكسر المواد العضوية والمخلفات العضوية وبالتالي ننتج عدة منتجات منها ومن أهمها اللي هو البلاستيك العضوي والوقود الحيوي.